Eaton Park restaurants are a staple here in western Pennsylvania. Loyal customers come for the milkshakes and the smiley cookies. But now, one of Pittsburgh's biggest chains is branching out into the world of spin-off restaurants, opening new eateries for whatever mood you're in. The Eaton Park brand is one of the local pioneers of spin-off restaurants. Small restaurants owned by a larger chain that serve the same quality food, but with a twist. Hello Bistro, The Porch in Oakland, and Six Pen Kitchen in Pittsburgh's Cultural District are all new spin-offs of Eaton Park. The Porch is an amazing place. It's built into the park. It's a great place to hang out and on a summer night and drink a glass of wine and have a great meal outside. Uh, Six Pen Kitchen is great for the, the Cultural District, and Hello Bistro has been really popular uh, for people who are looking for a great lunch. Hello Bistro has been popular among college students since its launch in 2012, as common locations for the restaurant are near Pittsburgh universities like Pitt and Point Park. While Six Pen Kitchen draws in theater goers from cultural district venues like Heinz Hall, right across the street. Eaton Park's goal for their spin-off restaurants is to open the perfect eatery for any occasion, whether it's a quick healthy lunch or a high-end dinner with friends. I had no idea that the porch was owned by Eaton Park. I think it's a really smart idea that they're opening places such as the porch and Hello Bistro. I never knew that uh, Eaton Park was owned, owned this place. I always thought it was a local place because, I mean, it seems so much fan so fancy. Thanks to the success of the current spinoffs, Eaton Park plans to add one more chain to the family. We're franchising a concept called Delicious Raw, and it's a juice and smoothie concept. Um, so it's all, all natural vegetables and fruit um, made into juices and smoothies. Customers can find the first delicious raw location right next to Hello Bistro on Wood Street downtown later this year. Reporting for Point News, I'm Hillary Maglin.